What's up guys? So I'm back with another video here. Finally got my mag dock, my mag ped. Now, this is from a company called Pataka. They did not sponsor this in any way. I actually did kickstart this myself. I paid for actually two of them. One came in this retail packaging, which is what I want to show you, the basic retail packaging. And the other was more of like a travel type kit that I purchased. It's the same thing, only it comes in like in a travel box. But this would be more like what the normal person would order. So this is their packaging. You know, their packaging right off the bat is very minimalistic type Apple kind of packaging. You got you at, at the bottom what the package includes. 30 watt USB-C charging adapter, which is good. USB-C charging cable. You get a metal plate, which is I'm not going to be showing in there. It's going to be it's going to be a totally different video. Um, they call an Apple Watch band locker and an Apple Watch case ledger. It's compatible with all uh, Qi enabled phones. Uh, I, you know, for iPhone 8 and, and, and all the way up to the XS Max, XR. It's going to work with any, basically any Samsung device. Um, I mean, literally any Qi enabled device this is going to work with. Now, the main reasons why, I'm, I'm assuming if you're watching this video, you know a little about, about Pataka. They kind of go around everything being magnetic and they want to make it as simple as possible. This is their mag case. I'm using it on my max here but yeah this basically works with a magnetic setup we'll show you in a, in, in a few moments but the unboxing itself is pretty damn simple and it, it's beautiful in a, a simple kind of way so you pull out you'll see this one i haven't even opened or even looked at so there you got the packaging the actual machine it's plastic this I'm not hundred percent sure. I think it's just a this is this is definitely plastic going around This feels like it feels like plastic as well, but it could be the same material that's on the back of this I'm not a hundred percent But you know, maybe somebody from Pataka can drop a comment down below Let me know if I'm wrong, but it does look like some Pataka branding there And that's really about it this part. You'll see in a moment. I just popped off that's it. Throw that to the side. And then you got this top piece, which connects, as you can guess, magnetically. And then you can turn it any which way you want. You know, they mainly show you either like that. That way you can look at your phone. Or if you want flat, that would be more or less flat. Then you got your USB-C place where you're going to charge here. Now you're only supposed to use their cord and their cable. It's a it's a power delivery cable and a quick charge. And then your Apple Watch is going to go here. Doesn't matter the model you have. We'll get into that in a moment. This is for the MagPad. MagPad. We'll show you in a moment what that's for. Um, they do have this on the bottom. I'm not sure what it's actually for. I guess maybe because this is a little bit sticky. But they say if you're going to move it around. It's advised not to take it off. So that's what we'll do. We'll not take it off. So what else do we get in the box? We got this. I'll show you in a moment what that's for. And it comes with another. Let's try to keep it as clean as we possibly can. So we'll toss that off. And we got this little box. I'm in the U.S. right now. So we got U.S. power adapter comes. Cool bean. You get your... USB-C, Pataka branded quick charger. I'll try to get this, there you go, it's nice, there you go. Made in Shenzhen, there you go. Don't want that. Get a decently large USB-C. Now apparently this is a power delivery cable. Again, you got some Pataka brand in there. Very cool, I like it. Nice and white. They're trying to keep the Apple lock. And now you got these. These are for your Apple Watch. We'll get to that in a moment. All right, so let's plug it up. Now, it's quite simple. I got a little, uh, I shouldn't say a little, I got a big power thingy here that we're gonna be plugging into. That way you guys don't think I'm pulling any games or tricks. <laughs> I just had that laying around. Yeah, it's kind of funny that I had that laying around, but yeah, I had that laying around. So you're gonna take that, just plug that into there. Yeah, nothing, nothing special there pop into there give some power 
hopefully this thing works. I've ne never even tested it. This is going to be the first time. So hopefully this doesn't fail. Now you're going to take that hole there. We're going to plug into there. All right. Now, for demonstration purposes, I'm going to put it in that fashion. That way we can see if she works or if I need to do something. B and H photo spamming me. There we go. Cool. I just had to press a button. So close that off. All right. So now we have power rocking. Now, as I said, this is their mag case. I'm going to link down below. If you were one of the backers, you got one of these for free. If not, I'm going to link down below where you can get a little bit of a discount if you do want to buy one. And you just pop it on and boom, she's charging. Now it's as simple as that. And then, like I said, if you want to change the orientation, simply just move it. Now it's, it's flat and it can look like that. And again, I'll bring it around. It's charging. It even holds on to this table for some reason. <laughs> there we go. See, magnetically it's charging. All right, now, remember I said they're going to get back to, back to this part, All right? Right now, we'll take the phone off. This part is going to, see there's a little connector here. This is for the MagPad. Now, not everybody bought a MagPad, but you need this anyway. This is for the Apple Watch. We'll see in a minute what that part is. All right, so, we got remember that little bag I was talking about? All right, so we're going to open that up. I really should use use my knife. Now, every one of these are going to be labeled. Let's see the camera. That's 38 millimeter. It's not mine. 42 millimeter. That would be Apple Watch zero through I guess three. Those two that I just showed you. 40 millimeters. And the next one should be 44 millimeters. That's the one I want. My Apple Watch 4 is going to be 44. Now you simply, I'll bring it up to the camera again so I can show you. You simply just slide into the little hole. I'm going to push it that way. So like that. And then you got that. I was wondering what that's for. That's like a I wonder if that's a charging light. These might be MagDoc, MagDoc Pros, actually. Hmm. Anyway. <laughs> Let's not get too crazy here. All right. Oh, it shows you on the side. I just noticed this now. Um, let's try to get that on camera. Power delivery, quick charge, input, five. I'm guessing that's volts, three amps, or five and three amps. Nine volts, two amps. Output is five... 2.4 amps, 9 volts, 1.8 ounce. Wireless output for phone is 9 volts, 1 amp. Wireless output 2 for Apple Watch is 5 volt, half amp. All right, now that would be the basic setup. Now, if you wanted to do your Apple Watch. Now, this is the part that's kind of interesting because you want to like wrap your Apple Watch around and then you're going to drop it on. And then that's it. Your Apple Watch is now charging. My Apple Watch is charging. Now this was their answer to uh, air power that never made it out. That's charging. Now I got to make this kind of like cool looking. I'm going to move it around. And then... I got that charging. Then, last but not least, we got our MagPad. Now, a MagPad was meant for, I mean, you could use, uh, if you had an Android phone, I don't, honestly don't have one. That's QI enabled, Qi enabled, I should say. But notice it's got that little, you simply just put it on the side, boop, and that's it. Now, I think I do have, yeah. I'll link down below where you can pick up one of these. 
but yeah, I got my uh, Qi enabled AirPods. And if you lay it down on this side, you can see that little light light up. So now I got my AirPods charging, my iPhone XS Max, and my Apple Watch charging. Sort of, should be more or less like, where we can give you the full presentation. It should be like this. All right. Should be more, more like that. You got everything charging right there, all in one little spot. I don't know if you can actually buy these right now, but I'm gonna do my best to throw links down below for everything you see here, including this little Qi enabled charger for my AirPods, the case. I'm gonna to try to go into a video where I'm gonna cut they're included. They include you like a little magnet that goes on the back of any of any case, basically. But what I think they forgot or maybe they were in a rush, you know, for whatever reason it may be. When you put it on the back of this phone, it's gonna cover the Apple logo about yay, maybe more. I wanted to put it underneath my skin. That way I could use whatever case I do want. It. I jump around cases. I use this one most of the time, but I like to jump around. Anyway, this is a rather long video, I guess. It's what, 11 minutes in. Um, we got it. I mean, it would work if I just went like that, but you know, you don't want your thousand dollar phone or in my case, almost a $2,000 phone just chilling there. <laughs> it's kind of dangerous. It's making me nervous. You definitely want, you know, nice magnetic. All righty guys. I hope you liked this video. It was quite simple. I've been waiting a while to get my hands on this. I haven't seen really any videos about it. I was hoping this would help you guys out. Um, to me, it's, you know, it's, it's worth, it's worth the money. I, I, I get, I want to be honest. It's worth 50, 60 bucks. I honestly wouldn't spend more. I saw another concept that they were working on. I'm hoping they actually bring it out. It looked like an air power. It was flat and it didn't need all these magnets. So you could use whatever you wanted. I kind of wanted that more, but now I like to support this company. They're nice. Some, some beautiful items. So if you got some money and you do like the idea of everything being magnetic, I mean, I honestly do. It's just that I jump around cases. And that's why I'm going to say I'm going to try to show you that other video. All right, guys, enough rambling. See you in the next one. Later, peace. Please, you know, thumbs up, share it around if you liked the video. Even if you didn't, just throw it on there and try to help me out. All right, guys, later. See you in the next one. Peace.